Hi, it's Marianne the Frugal Chef. Hey, let's uh, make a baked ham. I bought a nine pound ham yesterday for $11 on sale at the supermarket, so I couldn't resist, I got it. So let me show you how I make my glaze for these and let's bake it, okay? Let's score our ham, okay? We're just gonna cut about a third inch into the fat and make little diamond shapes. And that's just so that the skin just gets crispy, okay? All right, for our glaze, uh, I want you to put a 14 ounce jar of orange marmalade into, into a pan. We're just gonna let this liquefy. We'll let it you know, heat up and it'll liquefy. Then we'll add our spices to it, okay? Add about a quarter cup of dark molasses to this. Mix it well. So I added half a teaspoon of ground cloves. I'm gonna add half a teaspoon of nutmeg. And I'm gonna add half a teaspoon of cinnamon, okay? Mix that. And add a tablespoon and a half of Dijon mustard. All right, well, we'll just bring this to a little simmer and we'll let it simmer for a few minutes. Just wanted to get all those flavors, you know, to meld into each other. And we'll glaze our ham. All right, so let's glaze our ham. We're gonna put a nice, thick coat of it on it. I have an oven preheating at 375. This is a nine pound bone-in ham, okay? So it should be ready in a couple hours. What I'm gonna do is, I'm going to be watching it and probably within an hour, I'm gonna go ahead and cover it with foil if it starts getting too dark. I'm, I'm sure it is, because the sugars here are gonna start caramelizing, okay? All right, so this has been in the oven for about 30 minutes. So I wanna go ahead and put a, a little more glaze on it, okay? This glaze is nice and thick now that it cooled down. Yeah, this smells really, really, really good. Another half hour went by, looking good, looking good. Now I'm gonna go ahead and put one more um, coat of glaze on this and I will cover it with foil. Put it in the oven for another hour and our ham is ready. I wish you could smell this, guys. I'll see you in a little while. Check out this good looking ham, look at that. Yes, it is delish. Okay, I'm gonna let it sit for a little while and then I'm gonna slice it. You know what, we're probably gonna use this for a few days for breakfast, for lunch. Ah, amazing. Bon appetit, my friends, from thefrugalchef.com. Make sure you come and visit us. We have all kinds of recipes that are not in video form. Eat well, my friends, without going broke. Take care of yourselves and I will see you soon.